Hello, Regina. Hey, Steve. Sorry I'm late. I couldn't decide on which video to rent, so I hope you like Anne and the King. Well, I'm sorry, but I don't tolerate lateness. So, as a punishment, I'm afraid that there will be no foreplay tonight. And if you question me, I'll tack on no cuddling. Come on, Steve. Look, if this is about that faculty meeting, don't you think you're taking it just a little too seriously? Regina, look at this from my viewpoint for a second here. I am the vice principal. I cannot afford to be embarrassed in front of my underlings. Look, I appreciate that, Steve, but it undermines my authority if the rest of the faculty thinks I'm showing you favoritism just because we're seeing each other outside of work. Oh, so that explains why I got to miss my real buy and big old baked potato. Come on, Steve, look. I know it seems harsh, but you'll be doing me a really big favor. Well, since you put it that way, I guess a little embarrassment is a small price to pay for what we have. You really mean it, Steve? Because it's really important to me. Look, Piggy, I'm the last person to question who the boss is. As a matter of fact, I think that <clears throat> I have been a very, very, very naughty boy, and I think I deserve to be punished rather rigorously. <laughs> so why don't we forget about that video and play a uh, Buck the Blacksmith and Thomas Jefferson's Mistress. Well, uh, you best go and get away from here now, Buck. <laughs> yeah, you better come here, girl. You better come here, girl. <laughs>